Food may not have a star on the Walk of Fame, but it has reached celebrity status more than ever. People are asking, where does it come from? I think it's exciting that more people want to know about where it came from, how it was grown, who's growing it. That's a very positive thing. The Food Dialogues was a two-day, four-panel event featuring industry experts, farmers, ranchers, and consumers. One theme, popular culture has created a giant stage to inspire interest around food, from documentaries to TV culinary shows and celebrity chefs. We spoke to industry experts and panelists for their take on Hollywood's portrayal of the topic. It brings what we do to life. I think sometimes, you know, we, we see in movies, we see, you know, the red barn and we see 10 cows here and 10 pigs and the chickens. And it's a very idyllic picture. And, and farming has changed from that. I think the good thing about bringing food into the entertainment industry is people start to think about it. The challenge is how do they do that in a way that is accurate? And how do we do that in a way that gets good information to people? The entertainment industry has played a role in the trend of food by making it public, if you will, so viewers can now engage in in cooking and feeding their families. And they're making food fun. It's clear farmers and ranchers are key characters that need to be at the center of these stories. I see food on TV and it's glamorous and it's exciting if we can remember to celebrate the people who helped produce that food. I think that movies and books and all the magazine articles that are being written about food, chefs are like the new rock stars. I'm determined to make growers the next rock star. I love it. It's an invitation for us to have a conversation about where our food comes from, how it was grown, and who produced it, and I love the opportunity it presents for all of us. For an extended look and to join the conversation, visit fooddialogues.com.